Hi everyone and welcome back to another Season 7 WWE Supercard video. A uh, bit of a short video today, just got Wild Wednesday rewards and a ticket pack and also a few shout outs to a few people as well. Uh, like I said, if you do want a shout out in the game, feel free to drop me a message in game and I'll be happy to do that in my future videos. Um, let's start with a shout out then. Uh, first of all got captain poop who is my son's account uh, he's got two pulls today asker and biggie bio nearly swarm uh i'll give filthy five a shout out as well as in the he's currently in um well either he or she i'm not actually sure which uh which they are actually as i don't, I don't know the person but um they give me a good run in pvp and finished about 600 points above me in pvp so shout out to them uh fredo dark heart as well um been following me for quite a long time uh if you want to check out as well um rao chidari uh he said he didn't know whether i'd pronounce that right i hope i have um Rao Ch uh, Ch Chidari, um, Nikita 2.0, RKO Payton, uh, Rolling, Arachnid and The Saviour as well. So shout out to you guys, thanks a lot for uh, for following, subscribing, uh, thumbs up for the videos and everything as well. Um, thanks a lot for people that have been subscribing as well recently. If you are new, please do subscribe. Please do give us a thumbs up if you like what you see. And turn your notifications on to all. Let's get into the video then. Um, we have just done Wild Wednesday and we've got a ticket pack. Grand Challenge Reward. We'll get this done. Not expecting much as my luck with these has been pretty terrible recently. Yeah, and it continues. So Dexter Loomis and a Eo Shirai. However, that Eo Shirai is an F1 that will be of use. Um, like I've explained before, though, the bios and pretty much swarm males now aren't uh, of any use to myself. Um unless i get like the extremes of like if i can still get the christmas ones in the fusions i think they may have been removed now uh i've just done these huge holes as well off screen and i managed to get a f1 shotzi a uh, pro of alexa from it as well uh those i would definitely recommend the huge hole packs you're not guaranteed anything good however I've opened three, um, which is 7,500 credits, and I got two behemoths. Pretty decent, to be honest with you. Um, especially both being females as well. Females uh, really are worth more, I think, um, than, than males, because they're, they're harder to, to come by, I think. I don't know whether your looks any different or not. Um, ring domination as well is also starting tomorrow. Not sure who the undercards are as of yet. Um, Kane was the undercard in War Games. Will that mean that Undertaker is possibly an undercard as it tags with Kane? Who knows? We'll just have to wait and see on that side of things. Um, Wild Wednesday then. Let's see if we can get anything decent from this. First of all then, the usual enhancements. Behemoth Enhancement. Then the four tickets. Ten credits. Obviously New Year's is uh, just round the corner as well. So if you're uh, doing anything for New Year's Eve. Uh, unfortunately in the UK we've pretty much got uh, near enough a full lockdown across the country so nothing much really happening over here but if you are staying in hopefully you have a good night uh spend time with your families and things and uh obviously keep keep healthy and uh stay safe this one is a support a summer slam 20 
and the big one now hopefully we get something decent fingers crossed mm. Booker T Swarm Buddy Murphy which I think is either an F2 or an F3 um, that is those uh, PVP currently uh, I'd, oh I did get uh, I know it's not as good as quite a lot of people's out there but I managed to get my highest PVP 43,595 in the last uh, PVP so I was, I was quite happy with the result of that um, we're currently prepping for another TBG as well uh, I've won a couple of King of the Rings recently as well so just a little bit of a deck update on that side of things um, there is Saint Mick as well I can't remember if I showed you that in the last video that's for the half heroic and then we'll do the ring dome to get the full heroic uh, the fusions finishing a couple of days as well I'm really really hoping I can get a pro for this Razor Ramon or Kofi I would prefer the Razor as Razor was always one of my favorite ones uh, Shinsuke was one of my latest polls. Uh, my latest poll is, in fact, Roman Reigns. He's one of the strongest in the tier. Um, R Truth was another one that I got as well uh, within the last couple of days. Damien Priest, as well, the happiest superstar in the world of that image. R really thought that he could have. Uh, Posed a bit better for that one, but hey ho, it all brings character to the game. And Tamina was one of the ones I got from uh, King of the Ring uh, for winning it. And the previous one, King of the Ring, that I won was Bobby Fish as well. Uh, currently, I lost my last King of the Ring in about, uh, I think it was the second round to one of my teammates. Azura ready, fair play to him. Um, Trav and Bestwick, he beat me hands down. Congrats to him. Um, always do like a challenge. And he even said to me that if I wanted to win, he'd let me win it. But I'd rather, I'd rather challenge, I'd rather fight for it and win the battle. Unfortunately, I lost. So hats off to him. Brilliant. Um, so, like I say, not much really. Uh, going on in the game at the moment um, if I get any more pulls I'll show them in the next video and things and that's pretty much it uh, the two ways to win let me know if you guys have been doing that I tried four um, of them and I got 11 pieces every time uh, which is the lowest that you can 2000 credits for 11 silver pieces the worst I could get so I'm avoiding that mode at all costs um you have to be really lucky to get the hundreds and the 75s and above uh that is pretty much a credit eater there is chances of getting um ones in there like if i got bobby fish or shinsuke they would be pros really do fancy that kevin nash and then obviously the chances of the razor pro etc uh but um I'm not going for the two ways to win. It's one of the um, mini games, if you will, that you've got to pay for that I don't agree with. Uh, I've, I was reluctant to do the Bounty Breaker not so long ago, but I did I did well with them, to be fair. But they, they do cost a lot of credit, so if you are willing to have a go at that mod, be prepared to spend a lot. That's... That's all I can say. Uh, the other packs in the store, it's women's division, which have always been terrible. And the December birthdays, again, pretty much terrible. Nothing worth um, going for in there. But like I say, if you are looking at buying packs at the moment, I'd go for the huge haul. They are uh, the best value for money. Like I say, nothing's guaranteed, but by all means, if you are looking at packs, that is the pack to go for. Let me know what you guys have been getting um, pulls recently as well. Um, and big shout out to 
uh, like I say, the guys as well that did uh, message before. Like I say, Raul is uh, one of the members in my team as well. Uh, we'll just have a look at some of the other profiles that I didn't uh, show before. Uh, John Cena Pro from the Battlegrounds game. Nice little sort of card. That's one I haven't got myself. Um, Robert Roode from the Fusion as well. And the Cactus Jack from the Fusion. Nice cards there. See if there's any other difference. Uh, the Goon, if you haven't seen it. That's RKO Payton's Goon. Uh, the Chelsea Green as well. Really do like that image. Then uh, here is the TLC uh, Money in the Bank card at the moment, the Roman Reigns. That is the Roman Reigns Pro, very nice Pro. It's always good as well to look at other people's uh, profiles and you can see cards that uh, you may or may not have seen before. Andre the Giant. Really good, and my son has uh, a couple as well. He's got the Dexter Loomis Pro, which is a very good card, for, especially on his tier. Uh, the Pro of Nikki Cross as well, and the Naomi Biomechanical had decent luck in that as well. Uh, so, like I say, guys. Feel free to message me in game and uh, I will uh, mention, give you a shout out in the upcoming videos. So thanks again guys for uh, for checking in, really do appreciate the support and uh, the messages that everyone keeps sending me, especially when you're mentioning about the videos that you love the vids and keep up the good work, really do love that. Um, it is really nice to know and especially that you've chosen to watch my videos because there's quite a few YouTubers out there so I do really appreciate it. Thank you guys. If I don't do a video before New Year, have uh, have the best New Year that you can. Uh, obviously if you're old enough to have uh, beverages and things then hopefully you get merry as well. Have a great one and if I don't do a video like i say we will see you in the new year for plenty more content for the wwe supercard season seven i am expecting as well back end. i think back end of january possibly the royal rumble tier um might drop as it was mentioned with supercard that they was putting the fiend and alexa bliss in the supercoin store uh, back end of January, so that to me signals that the Royal Rumble tier probably will be coming by then. If not, uh, beginning of Feb, possibly, sort of around that time, with them putting those cards in, it usually means that the new tier will be coming. So thanks again, guys. Take care. Have a good one, and peace out. Thank you.